Hey guys, today I am here to do an update on my Hoyas. Today we have a total of five Hoya updates. Um, so I ordered these five roughly about three weeks, three and a half weeks ago, almost that one month mark. So I figure uh, it's time to do an update. So the first one is Hoya Isenses. So this one is not doing too much, um, it's just sitting in Leica as you can see. So um, they're pretty happy though, they're not you know, dying or stressed out or anything like that which is good. So as you can see this one is very shiny, this is new leaf, uh, it came like that, it came uh, like that uh, so it didn't grow under my care or anything like that. So this one is pretty good. Um, so you can see if I get up close, uh, you can see the vine, uh, the vein, not not the vine, the vein in there. Um, so they're pretty cute. So I have all my Hoyas that I'm about to show you today, either on the grow light or indirect bright indirect light. So this one is in um, indirect bright light uh, spot. So I guess we'll just have to give this one some time to get established, get going. So again, this is Hoya Eye Senses. So this is the first one. And the next one, I guess we'll go with this beauty. So this one is the uh, freebie. The seller in, uh, added this one in my order um, as a free plan or freebie, um, whatever you want to call it. Uh, again, in Leica. So this one has um, pretty good looking roots. Um, so this one is not doing too much. Oh, I didn't show you the name. So this one, oh, hang on, let me put this down. So, Here's the name. Uh, so I believe it's pronounced uh, Hoya Vitalina. Vitalina. You have to say it really fast to make sense. But it's Hoya Vitalina Splash. So as you can see, it has um, the splashiness on the leaves. So this one, let me turn on. The light, I think the light is too bright. Hang on one second. Let me see. Where is it? Okay. Um, so, so that way you can see the splashiness. The leaves is shiny too, so that's not very helpful. But you can see the splashiness right there. Those are all splashiness. So they're pretty cute. This one is older leaf, um, so it's not as shiny as the new leaf. So this one, I looked it up online. Their flower is really beautiful. I will insert a picture right next to it, maybe somewhere over there. Um, so you can see the picture of their flowers. Uh, of course, you know, hopefully this little girl, this little Billy, will give me flowers sometime this year. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. This is just a cutting. Um, but if they give me um, Padango or any new growth, I will do an update on all my Hoyas uh, once or if they give me Padango because that is very exciting whenever I see Padango coming. So this one is from the same seller. Oh, the last two, the last two Hoyas, um, they're all from the same seller, including this one. And this one is Hoya and Gloriana Vietnam. So this one is, I love the leaves. It's just very tiny looking leaves. Um, they're so cute. So up close. So if you look, 
um, from here, where is it? From here on up, those are all new growth uh, under my care. So I have this one again. Uh, I have most of my Hoyas in Leka. <laughs> So the Leka looks kind of white and nasty looking, um, but that is all from the water. It is normal. If you want to wash it, you can. You can just take out your plants nicely, gently, and then just wash your Leka. Um, I only do that once, uh, maybe once a month, because I don't want to bother um, their roots um, too much. So sometimes I will just even not even a month i would just do it every um two three months um so that's that and then that like i said that was all from one seller and the next one is from a different seller for the next two uh you will see the name of the seller in a minute so this is for um hoya globarosa so this one is the one that I lost two leaves when I did the unboxing. If you want to check out the unboxing, uh, please do. I will link the um, unboxing down below if you're interested to see how they look before and after unboxing, I guess. So this one is uh, fuzzy leaves. Uh, so they're doing good. So even though I lost two leaves, there's new growth. You see, um, the new baby leaf is coming out from there, which is exciting. So hopefully, um, I don't know, this one grows really fast because I broke, the. this one grows really fast. The leaf broke off and then it callous over and then right next to it, it decided to grow more leaves. So I know it's not Padango, so for sure is those are leaves, baby leaves. So, so I hope baby leaf will survive, will make it through. Um, so as you see this one, the seller, they have it in cocoa husk. So I didn't put this one in Leka because I feel like, oh, they're pretty happy in there. So I don't want to move them or take them out so if you can see up close my neighbor is uh, mowing so i don't know if you can hear that in the background if so please excuse that so you can see the fuzziness they're so cute you can i can touch them all day long they'll be like leave me alone don't touch me <laughs> okay so that's that one and the last one is Hoya Glabra. Hoya Glabra. So this one again, two leaves. Um, not doing too much, but just growing this um, stem or tendril. Uh, so this from here on up are all new growth under my care. So from here all the way up are just new brand new so this is the one that i can't stop looking <laughs> um at the veins uh, on the back of the leaves so they're just so pretty so one thing i do want to mention so you see this one is older leaves right you don't see a whole bunch of little veins uh, on the side of the main vein so if you look at the newer leaf um, so as you can see, so this one, the main leaf, I mean, the main uh, vein uh, on, on the side of it, there's like itty bitty little baby veins coming out from there. So they're pretty cute, very neat. I don't know if they will just slowly disappear as the leaves get older. And then if you look at the older leaves, this one has uh, a, a, whole, uh, a very deep dimple. I don't know what you call it, dimples? They're just not the same as the younger or newer leaves. See, the newer leaf, you can't see 
really can't see you can I can feel a little bit of dimple so I guess when this one gets older it will be something like that one the one the older leaf um, I guess you can really see and feel the dimple once it gets older so um, that's all I have for you today for updates um, so um, I know in the last two, two, three videos, I'm not sure. Uh, my very last unboxing, I said um, that will be my last unboxing and not gonna do any more purchase on Hoyas. And but um, yeah, that didn't go really, that didn't go well at all. Because I went to my local nursery, I bought more Hoyas. Uh, I will I will maybe insert a picture um, somewhere for you to see. And then on top of that, something caught my eye online. And yes, I bought more Hoya online. And yes, I'm going to do another unboxing. And yes, I will share that with you guys. I'm not ashamed of it. I am Hoya head and I am gonna sit here and admit that and there's nothing wrong with it. Nothing wrong with that. Not that I know of. <laughs> um, so here are all my Hoyas that we just looked at and I will insert a family picture of course. Always family picture at the end. Uh, please stay tuned for more uh, Hoya videos uh, and I will let you guys up know any uh, improvement, any padango on these new purchase Hoya. Well, not new purchase, but uh, about a month old Hoya. Um, so I guess I'll see you guys next time. Please stay tuned, subscribe and give me a like and tell me what you think. I see you guys next time. Bye.